Nigeria's president-elect Bula Metinibu has urged Nigerians not to pay attention to speculations about his health status. Tinibu made this known on Monday, April 24th, shortly after his return from holidays in Paris, France. As quoted in a statement issued by his spokesperson, Tunde Raman, the former Lagos State Governor, said, I'm happy to be back, I've rested, I'm refreshed, and I'm ready for the task ahead. Forget about what the rumor mill may have told you, I'm strong, very strong. Earlier on his return, Tinubu was welcomed at the Nambi Azikiwe International Airport, Abuja with streams of high-profile dignitaries and his supporters chanting his name, Jagaban. The APC stalwart was seen waving and blowing kisses at his supporters, and in excitement, he displayed the peace sign with his right hand while waving in excitement. As reported by the cable, Tinibu had been on a rest leave since the conclusion of the gubernatorial election. Rama revealed that the president-elect had been resting in France while visiting Saudi Arabia to observe the lesser hash during Ramadan. However, Tinibu's absence triggered a lot of rumors and speculation about his health status, with critics stating that he had been away for a medical checkup because of an unidentified health problem. Meanwhile, Tinibu camp repeatedly denied these claims, noting that the president-elect has been on a voyage consulting stakeholders in setting his team for the incoming administration. City Boy as his Gen Z supporters fondly called him is expected to be inaugurated as the new president of Nigeria on Monday, May 29 at the legendary Eagle Square Abuja to begin his first stint at the State House in Asurok. My viewers at home, was your reaction to this? As uh, Tinimu finally opens up on health status. Okay, the return of Jagaban. What's your take on this? Uh, please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section, your voice will and clear around the world. And ensure you subscribe to our channel for more updates on Daily Express. Alright, uh, in the words of Jagaban, he says, I'm happy to be back. I have rested, I'm refreshed, I'm ready to, for the task ahead. Forget about what the rumor mill may have told you. I'm strong, very strong. Okay. Uh, Rhoda here says uh, people who claim to be leaders can't be truthful for once. God help Nigeria. People who claim to be leaders can't be truth for once. God help Nigeria. Okay? See you taking more actions. Stay tuned, please, as we take more actions, okay? All right, we have more reactions here. Guest here says, uh, Righteousness exalts a nation. Righteousness exalts a nation, that's according to Guest. Then, uh, Shim Shima Ushe Ikeledu, yes, Shima Ushe Ikeledu also commented, saying, uh, What he is carrying on his arm. It's an indication that he went for medical treatment, but he is still lying to Nigeria and calling it rumor. See, so what he is carrying on his arm is an indication that he went for medical treatment, but he is still lying to Nigeria and calling it rumor. Then, Opa uh, Leke Ineka to Shima Ushe Ekeledu says uh, 
They are deceiving us, thinking that we don't know what is happening. Say they are deceiving us, thinking that we don't know what is uh, happening. What is your take on this? Uh, please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section and your voice will be and clear around the world and ensure you subscribe to our channel. We are still taking more reactions. Stay tuned. Please, as we take more reactions, okay? Stay tuned, please. Alright, uh, we have another reaction here from Olatun Boshun George Olagoki. Yes, from Olatun Boshun George Olagoki. And he says, uh, Where are the Obi goats and the whalers? Their sorrows must have greatly quadrupled since yesterday night. So, where are the Obi goats and the whalers? Their sorrows must have greatly quadrupled since yesterday night. Okay, uh, that is according to George Olagoke, uh, sending strong message to Labour Party members and uh, using, uh, you know, sh should I say a uh, grammar? Uh, say, say. Uh, their sorrows must have greatly uh, quad quadrupled since yesterday. In other words, their sorrows must have been increased uh, since uh, yesterday. Uh, it, it sent a strong message to Labour Party members. Okay? Uh, but we do not encourage people, you know, trying to cause uh, disharmony, quarry, you know, making people, uh, you know... Uh, uh, calling people names, please. Next time, you just send, you make your comments. You know, don't uh, insult people, and don't don't uh, call people names, please. Okay. Ola uh, Tuboshu George Lagoke, please uh, take note. All right, uh, Tinibu is back to the country, and uh, uh, I'm I'm sure his uh, supporters. Are happy that uh, he came uh, in a very healthy way. Yes, very healthy way. He shall not tie will hear also did uh, commented and uh, he says, uh, I wish him well. I wish him well. That is according to Ishola Taiwo. Yes, uh, he came in a very healthy way, saying that uh, he's okay, heal and hearty, and I'm sure. Uh, Nigerians uh, saw him, uh, you know, moving very well and uh, uh, healed and hearty. Okay, thank God for that. This all can take for now. Thanks and God bless. And ensure you subscribe to our channel. Bye for now. Please, thanks so much for listening. Okay, and bye for now. Please, okay. Stay tuned for more reports.